Good afternoon, guys. Yes, third day. Sorry I didn't get with you guys yesterday on changing the hydro filter. I, you know, I didn't want to do a video, man. It was rainy out. It rained today again. Um, things are starting to finally dry up. It's about 2.30 in the afternoon. Um, we have, and, and beep, 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 weather alert. For Columbus, next Tuesday through Saturday, we are going to get rain showers every day. 50 to 75% chance every day. This month is completely shot. You don't get these days back, guys. You do not get them back. So we will do what we can. There may be long periods where I'm not making videos, but uh, hey, that is what it is. I... I'm going to change my buddy's oil on his X mark today. I'm not going to bore you with that. Uh, I also am going to sharpen up some blades for another guy and uh, make a little bit of extra cashish, you know. But uh, the filter went great yesterday. It's ready to go. Um, I did buy something new today, so I want to show you that. And... Uh, hasn't changed at all but man i needed it and uh you know i don't like buying new equipment at all but it, it had to be done so uh let me show you what i got okay guys that's what i got brand new fs 111r uh, I needed it, so I went to one dealership. I, I don't know how this happens, but it does. I went to one dealership. They wanted four sixty nine. I called the other dealership, and I got this for three seventy nine. How you can give ninety dollars off from one place to another with it being the same machine I don't know okay I don't get it but I'm not paying ninety dollars ninety bucks for something that I don't have to pay ninety bucks for so first thing we got to do is what every self-respecting lawn care guy does is get rid of that strap if somebody needs a strap I got like three or four of them you can have them okay the next thing we're going to do is get rid of that speed feed head right there and we're going to get rid of this thing right here okay you, you don't need them i'm just saying you don't need them and the dealer said you know what you want the echo speed feed head he handed me the box and said it's yours free of charge so i don't know what that thing costs like 30 40 bucks free of charge, got the trimmer for uh, $379, what a deal, let's start it, let's go see it runs. Notice I get a little vibration on the tip with having that speed feed head on there. 
Ooh, that's a lot of line. A little bit too much. be able to see the vibration but to go fellas for tomorrow now I just got to put the uh, green touch things on it and I am replacing that one right there that FS 111 she's been good but she's got some issues if uh, anybody is interested in buying it I will literally sell that thing for 50 bucks uh, I don't know what's wrong with it. I mean it runs it runs, but it's uh, something's wrong with the gears in it I can tell you that it'll rev and then the head will kick in so if Somebody wants it. It's 50 bucks Anyway, I'll be right back Okay guys, I'm just getting ready to bolt this up And I've had so many green touch racks But I have so many of these extra so, I'm going to show you how I do it on here. A lot of people pull them on from the back to the front, but I like to push them on and slide them in. So, I'm just a little odd. I get it. I get it. I hope you guys are having a blessed day, man. We got to go to a revival this week. So, even though it was raining, we were blessed to hear a great preacher. And uh, just had a great time, man. A lot of prayers. And uh, thank you guys for the prayers you offered, Tim. And, uh, you know, things are working for folks. So, let's see here. Let's just put it on here. Let's figure out where we want to put this. think I like that just like that what do you guys think well this needs to turn so that's got to turn a little bit and you definitely want to get these snug trimmer out to come back to the thing, put it in, close it right down. Set the perfect on there. Let me tighten these up. Getting ready to start raining again. I do not want to get caught in the rain. It'd be like the fourth time this week. Now let's see if she's ready. There she is, guys. And a lot of you are probably like, man, doesn't that shaking, like, hurt anything? No. It, it You can bolt them on from the bottom of your trailer, your green touch racks. I just put them right on the rack, man. I don't have any trouble with it. I'm good. Tremor's running great. Look, I don't like to spend money, but my tremors were giving me fits, and you ain't going to complain about getting... 100 and 
$30, $120 worth of stuff for practically free. I mean, I cannot believe that one dealer can go to $469, the other dealer can go to $379. I don't care, okay, guys? I'm just telling you, I don't care. But I'm not spending $90 more for something that I can get for $90 less. Uh, no one would do that out there, okay? So there she is, brand new trimmer. And uh, we are checking into 52 V rides for next year already. So we'll see, we'll see where that takes us. We don't know. We'll see where it takes us. So things are getting really rough out here, guys. I know this wasn't much of a video, but I wanted to... Uh, tell you that we are giving away another capri tool this saturday at uh probably eight o'clock because i'm going to be out working as late as i can and um i just appreciate all you guys all you viewers um all the new family members all the new subscribers you guys are great and uh thanks for all the support and you know you just, it just doesn't get much better than that, man. We're all going through this same thing. A lot of guys are having great weather and they're able to work every day. And some of us are just having horrible weather. And and up north, man, it's just par for the course. So, sorry I haven't been able to bring you a video every day like I said I would the other day. But I will do my best. But when it is raining, there's just not much to talk about. So, guys, hope you enjoyed the new equipment i know i'm going to enjoy it for about a day until it gets old because that's what stuff does when you use it it just gets old and it's no longer new and shiny so before you spend a lot of money on stuff think about that as soon as you buy that mower it's going to be dirty at least it should be if you're out mowing grass i mean i've seen guys polish their mowers up and stuff i don't understand it that mower is to make me money and it should be dirty every day of the week if not i'm not doing something right so have a great day dr real was in the house keep it real guys thanks for watching i'll see you tomorrow peace